Hi, well, uh, I'm back with another video about how to grow vegetables in the garden. And I know it's April and your neighbors are going to say you're crazy. And they might be right. I'm crazy too then because I'm out in the garden planting here onions. These are onion sets and these are red onions. You can buy yellow onions, white onions, or red onions, onion sets. They're inexpensive, like very inexpensive, and uh, easy to grow. You need well-drained soil, so lots of sand, and like potato soil, right? Um, and you need lots of sunshine, which is true for most vegetables anyway. I'm going to plant these about four inches apart, 10 centimeters, and about an inch and a half deep, which is maybe four centimeters. And they're going to go right in the ground like so, all right? You'll see, well, like so. There we go. Got to talk to the cameraman here. And uh, you'll notice I'm using a line. You see this thing here? That's because I'm directionally challenged. Now, maybe you are, and you need one of these. It's a line, but maybe not. You can make a straight line without a string. But I do find that it helps. By the way, while we're out here, I've got my floating row covers over here, and they're providing uh, shelter for some snow peas, for some um, uh, calendula, uh, lettuce, leaf lettuce, arugula, some uh, Mark's Choice mescaline, mescaline mix, and um, always use lots of compost. Remember what I said? Maybe you didn't see it, but uh, worm castings. I, I put about one-tenth worm castings by volume whenever I'm sowing seeds or I'm working out here in my vegetable garden. I have about an acre. It's starting to snow, so it might be a good time for me to go into the uh, greenhouse, and I'm just going to use my... Uh, my now famous uh, Mark Story's garden hole. It's called a back hole. And I'm going to finish the job with that. And into the greenhouse I go. More information coming your way. Mark Cullen, markcullen.com. Thanks a lot. Hey, Ben's up tomorrow.